So write this formula down. D, D stands for density. P stands for pressure. Capital M. I'll tell you that in a minute. R, constant. T, Kelvin temperature. I know this is important. I'm going to explain. So, M is equal to molar mass. That would be off the periodic table, or, you know, if you have to add up, you know, like, O2, you know, 16 times 2, whatever. You guys know that. P is equal to pressure. Uh, generally, that should be put into ATM. Now, remember your units for molar mass? It's grams per mole. Write that down. So remember, molar mass is, you know, it's so many grams, like, you know, oxygen is 16 grams per one mole of something. Pressure needs to be in ATMs. Uh, R, we know our constant, 0 0.0821. Uh, temperature, I mean, temperature in Kelvin. All right. And again, just so you know, this is right, this is on, right there. It's given to you on the test. And then, and then one other one that I'm going to show you today. Yeah, I will give that to you. Every other test? Yeah, that's the point. Hey. Now, what? This thing where it gives us like No. Yeah, that's on there too. Now, for a density problem. Okay, a density problem is meant to be relatively straightforward and simple. Like for, all I'm going to do is give you some examples right here. I'm not going to make anything fancy. The wording on the test questions for these aren't very complicated either. I'm just going to say, okay, for, uh, for methane, CH4, what is the density at STP? I mean, that, that's pretty representative of a type of problem you will see. What he's doing. What he's doing. Why would he... Oh my God. Now, uh, <coughs> now all you got to do, I mean, STP, what's STP tell you? What's the temperature at STP? 273 Kelvin, pressure is equal to one atmosphere. Simple. Okay. Uh, do we know what R is? Yeah, I mean, obviously, you know what R is. How about M, molar mass? So methane is C is 12.01, H is 1.01. You got four of them. So it adds up to 16.05. Uh, so 16.05 grams per mole. Now, we'll write this down. So oh, this is at standard. Uh, this is at standard. This is standard temperature pressure. I thought you said um, when I was doing the problem, it was at standard temperature, and then I was like, okay, so it's like one point seven three. You said no, you didn't mean to do that. You'd have to show me, Danielle, because I don't remember that. So we know. I mean, now do you see why I'm saying these problems are easy? Yeah. So, so all you simply do, you just take all your stuff and plug it in and solve the problem now. You know all four variables in your equation, so I'm going to rewrite it. Density is equal to pressure minus RT. So all you do is simply say your pressure is one atmosphere. Well, what do we, so what do we write as a unit when we solve for when we get density? You'll see. I'm going to show you. So one atmosphere, 16.05 grams per mole. And then our R value is 0.0821 liters times atmospheres divided by moles times Kelvin. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh. Okay. Now, what I would like you to do, just try for yourself here to find density. What will our units for density be? Cancel stuff out. I think I found it. What is Ra? Grams over liters. Because if you look, Atmospheres cancel out, your moles cancel out. 
your temperatures cancel out, and you're left with grams over liters. So make a note. Density's mm -hmm. unit. Let me move this here. The unit for density is equal to grams over liters. Okay? You see how temperatures, how K is on top here, K is on the bottom there? Keep that in mind. What does our density actually come out to be here? 0.7 what? 0.72 is fine. So that's how you do density.